Hey guys, this is Steve. I'm going to show how I do a DX9. I know somebody asked about a DX8. And this is a non-edited video. I'm just going to do this kind of live and as I go. Um, I'm doing the transmitter as a separate piece. and I'll just blotch them together when I go into real flight. But first I wanted to show off what I got on DX9. I have a dedicated SIM uh, set up here in Heli Config. And if you look, and here's how I have mine set up. My flight modes are on this switch right here. So it's a three-way switch. Those are my three flight modes. And then I have throttle hold. I like it just where real flight usually puts it back here, right, on that switch. So if you look at my transmitter channels here, you'll see that. Um, we'll go over them, I guess. So throttle is on, you'll see channel one and channel uh, gosh, one, two, three, four, five, six. So channel one and six are, this is putting out a flat curve on both channel one and six for a mode two throttle. And then my rudder is on channel four. You can see that. Um, the flight mode, which is on the left-hand switch, that Stunt is Stunt two. It's like channel five, right? Stunt the gear one. channel. Normal so that's where mode. I do my Stunt flight one. three flight Stunt modes. Mode. And then throttle hold I have over here on AX2, which I think is channel seven. So I'm actually using channels, uh, seven channels here to do this. Although I think in real flight you can tell it to, which I think I'm doing it anyway. I'm not. I'm not even using channel six in real flight. I don't think. It's just using one channel in real flight. So you you could, if you had a six-channel transmitter, you could use that sixth channel for throttle hold instead of channel seven like I have. Uh, this does allow me to break the uh, the two channels out if I want to have you know any special separate throttle and pitch curves as done in the transmitter, not in real flight. So. Just thought I'd throw, show really quick how my transmitter is set up, and now I'm going to plug in the uh, WS, what is it, 1000 do I have? This is the older dongle. So yeah, SPM WS 1000, which I'm, I don't know how much different the 2000 is, if at all. It's a little bit sexier looking. This is a little bit older school. And you got a bind button here on the very end, so. I'm going to hook this up to my computer and bind it. In the next uh, part of the video here, you'll see uh, what I'm doing on the computer. 